Righto, so why we're here at SNL debating the the new van purchase. I thought I'd show you the the van that I filmed a few weeks ago now that was in the very early stages of build. Uh, they've had to pause work on this while they are building the van for the NEC show. The person that owns this van is quite happy for them to stop working on it. But yeah, this was the one that I showed you. It's got bonded windows in it. It's got some lovely sexy alloys on it, now rogue alloys on it. Looks pretty nice from the outside that, doesn't it? Um, and it's virtually finished inside. It's got a transverse bed in it. It's got a diesel heater on. They're running the heater up to test it at the moment. Um, let me quickly show you on the roof of this one. It's got a humongous solar panel on. I mean, we're talking huge. Look at the size of that. Still got the protective stuff on the top side. There we go. A little bit of dust in here from, from obviously the cutting. But that's about 360, 370 watt solar panel, something like that. It's a huge one. And if I just come down this ladder, don't worry, I've looked at the RAM certificates, we're fine. So if you remember this from the early videos, it was all marked out on the floor. This is a van that it's not an SNL design as such. As I said before, they will build you anything you fancy. So you can see it's got the little bench seat there, your normal cupboards and cabinets, a massive fridge there. And uh, it's waiting for a bit of bathroom stuff. I think it's waiting for a shower tray because it's got to have one of them shower trays that's got the wheel arch intrusion in it. And then it's obviously got a fixed transverse bed. It's uh, lovely. It's amazing how wide they make these aisles in these SNLs. I do, I do love the fact that you don't have to squeeze down there. But yeah, in in the underneath part there, if you remember me saying, it has got a huge uh, inverter in there and all the kit you can need to charge that up. I think it was a 400. 400 amp lithium battery as far as I remember anyway. What do we think? Lovely. Hmm? If you've got a vision, the guys will build it. So we're in, we're in build with a couple of vans. This is a very early build stage on an Apollo. There's absolutely nothing in it but the windows have been cut out, roof lights have been cut out. Obviously insulations and flooring is done. You can see the barrier matting under there and the flooring. So this is on a Peugeot. Basically everywhere is struggling for Fiat supply. Um, so Peugeot or nothing at the minute with these unless you're willing to wait. It's the same with us, you know. Still not heard about the Fiat, so. But the Peugeots are okay. It's just the obviously you've got the old style dash with them. But, there we have, the bumper is off, in for paint coating. This one here, the white one, this is going to be the star at the NEC show. Um, I may have already released this video out of sequence. This one's for sale at the NEC. It's just about finished. Obviously an Apollo on a Peugeot got the majority of the toys on it that you'd need basically ready to go just finishing off and then the guys will be down there from Tuesday onwards come and see them we'll be there on the Friday and the Saturday probably see us around the stand but yeah it's taken them 11 days to build this so far I've just been told that we're nearly there as I say, they've had to pause working on one of the other ones just to get this done. But it just goes to show how quickly they can get these built to the quality that they are. Uh, if, me, if my camera's flickering, I apologise. There's LED lighting everywhere. But, uh, yeah, there we go.